do it by reading the Bible. Okay, so there's only one goal in my ministry to my members in the church. That is to encourage them to read the Bible, to read the Bible, to read the Bible. And reading the Bible will actually help you to understand more about Jesus Christ in your life. Okay, so would you commit to journey with God through reading the Bible? That is actually the expectation after you experience a real born again in your life. I myself, let me tell you something that I myself enjoying Bible reading every day. And more than one year now, I am now in 2 Samuel chapter 13. Right? So I want you also to experience Bible reading and uh, if you ask me, Pastor, what Bible or what book in the Bible should I start reading? And I will recommend to you the book of John. It's the story of Jesus Christ. A wonderful story of Jesus Christ and I want you to to learn more about Jesus Christ, the life of Jesus Christ. All right? So, shall we kneel as we have this commitment prayer? Our great God in heaven, Lord, this very moment, we would like to bring back the honor and glory into your name for giving us this wonderful chance to talk about baptism, about being born again, and about real disciples of Jesus Christ. And Father, here are your sons and daughters. In their young age, they decided to commit themselves to your hands through the ritual of baptism as a symbol of dying their old self and experience the newness of life. I pray, Lord, that may you Help them through the ministry of the Holy Spirit to keep in going and going until Jesus Christ will come for the second time. Lord, I would like to commit, to commit themselves unto your hands this afternoon as we um, go to the water grave of baptism. I would like to pray that may you help them and guide them further. And there are many challenges ahead of them, but I would like to Pray that may your Holy Spirit remind them about your love to each one of us. And thank you, Lord, for the assurance. Thank you for hearing and answering our prayer. In Jesus' name, amen. Okay. For our closing song, I'm inviting everyone to please stand and as we sing our close, closing song, theme song, My Life is Sorry.
Let us all bow our heads as we pray. Loving God, our Father in heaven, we thank you for, your, for all your blessings today. We thank you that yeah, you've been with us throughout this week of prayer. Father in heaven, we ascribe all the glory to you. May the Holy Spirit be upon us, upon all of us, and especially upon those who will be baptized this afternoon. May you be with these young brothers and sisters. May they walk, Father, in righteousness as your disciples. And not only they, Father in heaven, but all of us as well. We ask all these things in Jesus' name. Amen. May we, we will now proceed to the baptismal pool for the baptism. The swimming pool rather. Sa baba po. Sa baba.